hey, I have this other opportunity that's out there. And then they get to the other side and they realize, man, this isn't what it, it was supposed to be. It's not living up to the hype. It's not living up to all of those things. So I don't want you to make that mistake. Common saying goes, the grass is usually never always greener on the other side. We live in this world of instant gratification of social media highlights and reels and everybody thinking that everybody else has it made so incredibly well and that there's no faults and everybody else is perfect or at least close to perfect, right? And so we think that if we go and pivot and try to do something else or if we do X, Y, and Z new business that the grass is gonna be greener on the other side and rarely is that actually the truth. And I've been that person that has chased this shiny object after shiny object that has hired uh, X, Y, and Z person or went in and gone to this event and taken this course and thinking all those things and, and said, hey, if I get here in my business, whether it's monetary value or any of those types of things, I said, that's when everything will be okay. There's no point in business as entrepreneurs if you're a visionary and you're somebody that wants to continuously level up where do you get there and you're like okay now i'm good when you get to that next level you're like okay what's that next level and what's the next five levels from there and so if you're solely focused on getting to a next spot or that next place on the mountain the entrepreneurial journey then Think back to why it is you are thinking that way. Because if you know yourself and if you look yourself in the mirror, you're gonna be like, man, you know what? I'm probably not gonna be satisfied here. And if I only focus on that, or if I focus on potentially trying to start something else, or if you're working for somebody, you're like, I'm gonna go work for this other company because on the outside looking in, it looks 10 times better and everybody thinks that this company is so much better than where I'm at right now. And if I could just get over there, life will be better. Everything will be better. I'll be making more money. I'll be having more time at home, all those things. Sometimes that is the case, but I'm here to tell you, I see so many people jump from company to company. They'll even jump from marketing company to marketing company. They'll start business after business thinking that that next venture is the venture that's going to make everything better. And then they get to the other side and they realize, man, this isn't what it, it was supposed to be. It's not living up to the hype. It's not living up to all of those things. So I don't want you to make that mistake. If you're thinking right now, hey, I have this other opportunity that's out there. I just encourage you to really do your due diligence because I've made some very, very costly mistakes, not just in costing me money, but also costing me freedom my time, my energy, just overall mental stability over the last couple of years because I was chasing the shiny object thinking that when I got to X point, not only with grass was going to be greener, but everything else would be solved. The grass is going to be the greenest wherever you water it. I can guarantee you if you're thinking about other opportunities or if you're thinking about switching company or if you're thinking about finding a new partner in a business, I'm telling you, you probably should be watering the grass a little bit greener right where you're standing today. Now, again, I'm not telling you to stay doing it if you don't love doing it or if there's other issues that obviously aren't on the surface level, but I can almost guarantee you, you could be putting in more time, energy and effort, resources, potentially money, and making what you're doing today, making your current situation, your current opportunities just that much better. It's so much easier, typically, to go and fix what is currently in front of you than to stop doing that and then going off in a different direction. You're gonna have to rebuild and start and do all of those things in that other direction or get acclimated with a new company, acclimated with a new marketing partner or any of those types of things. So just as you're taking a look at your current opportunities, your current instances and things like that, just know the grass is not always greener on the other side and it's usually not the grass will absolutely be the greenest wherever you water it and if you go to that other opportunity that's totally fine just know you're probably going to have a lot of the same issues or potentially some of the same issues that you're currently dealing with today because a lot of this stuff has to do with who we are as individuals and you're going to have to water that grass and make sure that grass is green over there as well thank you very much for watching today's video 
I encourage you to do an audit of where you're currently at, what you have going on, the pros and cons of continuing to do what you're doing or potentially making a switch if you need to, whether it's another company you're starting, whether it's bringing on a new partner, whether it's going and working for a different company if you're currently an employee. Thank you very much for watching today's video. I hope you got some value out of it. Feel free to leave some comments, feedback, things like that below, and we'll see you next time.